Good morning. Have a great Monday, everybody. It's a chilly start. We've got widespread frost advisories around much of our region thanks to a nice ridge of cool, high pressure that's building on in. But because we have high pressure, that's going to leave us with abundant sunshine. And we're going to be tracking our next frontal boundary. It's a low pressure system to our north and northwest. That's going to be tracking its way into our area as we get into our Tuesday night, Wednesday morning. But watch this by 7 o'clock Tuesday night. Most of the rains to our north and west, Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. It just kind of fizzles on out, so I don't think it's going to be any major impact to our daily lives. And again, that comes in Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. So today, a chilly start, but sunshine and warmer weather, increasing high clouds, a bit on the breezy side as that cold front approaches Tuesday into Wednesday, but very light morning rain on Wednesday, then sunshine Wednesday afternoon. And then we'll be tracking another cold front as we get into our Friday, Saturday of this week. So again, here locally through 9 o'clock this morning, we do have those frost advisors in place. So temps in the 30s, it's a cold one for sure. We're going to be climbing into the mid-50s as we get into the lunch hour. And forecast highs today below average but warmer than yesterday. We're going to be in the low to mid-60s. So that's not a bad afternoon. Sunny and 65 is literally like the perfect day. As we get into the evening hours by 8 o'clock, we'll still hang on to the low 60s. So a nice evening to take a nice little walk after dinner. Uh, 10 o'clock tonight, we're going to be in the low 50s. So it's going to be another chilly start to our day tomorrow. We're talking temperatures in the 30s with a few more pockets of 40s. Less frost to be forming on into our Tuesday morning. So frost doesn't look, look like it's going to be a major player. But it is going to be warmer on Tuesday. We're going to see those temperatures climb back into the 60s and low to maybe even some pockets of mid-70s. So a nice little pattern on the way. But as I mentioned, Tuesday is going to be on the breezy side. And winds are going to be gusting out of the southwest ahead of the cold front. Anywhere from about oh, 15, 20, 25 miles per hour or so. So not a windy day per se, but just a little breeze, if you will. And your three-day forecast, we're going to see those temperatures continue to climb. Nice ridge of high pressure starts to build its way out into the area. So that's going to help uh, to warm our temperatures into the 70s to maybe even warmer weather as we get into next weekend. So about 20% chance for some early morning showers on Wednesday. And then Friday into Saturday, maybe late lingering into Sunday, a chance for a little bit of light rain, not expecting much. But look at these temperatures. We'll continue to warm. We're going to be in the mid to upper 70s to low 80s as we get into the weekend and the start of next week. And our low temperatures will be in the 40s, 50s, and 60s with another chilly start to our day tomorrow. Now, the Climate Prediction Center is also predicting the possibility of above average temperatures as we round out the month of April and start the month of May, so some nice weather is on the way. Hey, check out check out the latest uh, forecast with the East Tennessee Weather app. It's everything you need for us here at East Tennessee, but again, it travels wherever you go. You have access to the only 24-hour weather channel here in East Tennessee, a great interactive radar, day parts, daily forecast from yours truly. Download it today. Go to the Google Play Store or the App Store and search East TN Weather, all one word.